Hey everyone, my name is Felix and I am currently on the set of The Chosen where I'm working with the behind the scenes team to show you all the cool things going on in between camera takes, behind the camera, in front of the camera, all that stuff I'm here to show you. So today I wanted to take you through a typical day, stuff that I go through to find that content to present to you. So let's go. So this is the pavilion where we have breakfast. I'm about to show you the goodness that is our daily breakfast. All right, so don't look now, but behind me is Alan. I only know his name because you hear it being yelled on set everywhere. Alan, tell the people what it is you do and uh, why your role is so important on set. I am the on-set set deck representative. So I am responsible for all the set decoration as we shoot on set. I work with the director and the DP to make sure that everything is how they want it when we roll the cameras. There you go. Thanks so much. So I'm on the lower lot right now. This is actually my favorite time of day. This is about an hour or so before everything gets started. But this is when everyone gets all set up and I'll show you a little bit of what it is we're doing. We've got people setting up lights and we've got people setting up fills and all these crazy things that I don't even really know what they are just yet. But this is when everyone's getting stuff ready. And uh, I like walking around during this time of day and just talking with the folks to understand uh, what to expect in the, in the scenes for the day. So it looks like we're about to get ready. We just got done with rehearsal. The actors went back to get to get ready for the scene and everything is culminating to this point where we call action and then the day gets started. And it's still a little bit cool, which is nice. And I've actually got Dallas over here. I like to ask him kind of what to expect during the day. Oh, Dallas, hello. <laughs> you got a second to, to tell us what uh, what's on the docket for the day. Well, unlike the last five days, we don't have 50 extras, we don't have we're not exploring a huge amount of space, so it's a little bit more intimate. So the first scene we've got, uh, this is episode eight is where we start. I don't want to give too many spoilers away, but we've got an exchange between a husband and wife inside. We've got like four different scenes in different parts of our entire set today. So while the scenes themselves aren't complicated, we've got several of them and they're all over. So there's a lot of moves, we call them company moves, where the whole whole crew moves to one other location. That part's gonna be a little bit nerve wracking because we got a lot of space to cover and a lot of uh, people to get to, a lot of scenes to get to, but the scenes themselves are actually my favorite kind of scenes. This is the more emotional stuff, the character arcs, the character journeys um, with just a couple people. So uh, it's not, I'm, I'm a little less brain crazy today than I was the last five days. But the key then is to not relax and take things for granted. So we still gotta move, but today should be um, again, I'm, I, I like to say cautiously optimistic or positively pessimistic, but either way, we'll make it. Excellent. Thanks so much. Yep. All right, I'm gonna go find someone else to bug so you can get the scoop on everything that's happening on set. take of the day. Everyone's got to be quiet, they roll, and we just sit and wait. I'm gonna go find Video Village so we can kind of see what the cameras are seeing. So 
this is Video Village. This is where we've got monitors sometimes. Dallas, the director, is here and we'll look at the monitors to make sure the take is good. But basically what the camera is seeing is what these monitors are seeing. Uh, so you can sit here and kind of watch the scenes play out as they're going to be played out uh, in the finished product. So one of the big challenges of shooting out here in the middle of summer is dehydration, just staying hydrated and staying cool. And a lot of the actors are wearing just pounds and pounds of fabric. So we've got folks on set who are there to make sure we stay hydrated. They've got popsicles that they're handing out. Uh, yes, you thank you so much. Uh -huh. The water with the, uh, the pickle brine in it is to replenish that sodium that you lose when you sweat. But I can't really complain too much because I'm in a, <laughs> a t-shirt and a pair of shorts and kudos to our crew to making sure that everyone is nice and hydrated. Here is Miss Charmaine. Hello. Hey. There's a rumor going around that there's going to be a dog on set today. There is. Matthew's dog plays today. Okay. His name is Jet. The dog's name is Jet. The dog's Matthew name is Jet. Matthew didn't name him Jet. No, like he a... plays as dog. <laughs> he plays as dog, okay. <laughs> yes. Can I come find you when dog is on set? Absolutely. Uh, excellent. Their uh, call time is 1230. 12 and so okay. we'll, we'll stage Jet. He's got um, two people, trainers, yeah. handler, excellent. that will be using him. So I just make sure that they're safe and make sure everything's good for Jet. All right, thanks. <laughs> uh -huh. been down in this lower lot quite a bit just to catch interviews and, and b-roll and just capture everything that's happening during takes and in between takes but every time I'm down here I catch something new because they're constantly building new sets and repurposing sections that they've already shot at for, for different scenes and there's always something that catches my eye and this section wasn't even here yesterday and now we've got this whole new place for for everyone to, to play in these are actual fish dried out uh, and you can tell because of the smell. <laughs> they didn't have Samsung touchscreen refrigerators back then, so this is how they sorted. This is Tupperware in the first century. But all over the ground, you'll notice these little T's. They look like uppercase T's. Those are marks. That's so the actors know where to stand. They know where to walk into frame. So they'll be in the camera. They'll be framed up correctly, and they can move around, and they'll be in the correct spots. So that's what those uh, those colorful T's are, and the colors denote the different the different actors. So they're all in the correct places throughout the scene. And just like that, this set is cleared out. Called wrap, the day is done, everyone's heading home. And we'll be back tomorrow for a 5.30 p.m. call, which means we are going until 5.30 a.m. I have no idea how my body's going to respond to that, but uh, one way to find out, right? Today was as smooth and easy as one can expect, and that's really fun. So this is one I actually enjoy filmmaking. Last five days I didn't enjoy it as much. I, I enjoy having done it, and now today I enjoy doing it. So that was that was a nice little respite in the middle of it.